What is going on my shiny cardboard enthusiasts? Welcome back to the channel guys and today we're going to be doing my predictions and speculations for the next Zenkai Series 2 set scheduled to release on November 18th. But before we dive into the opening guy, before we dive into the discussion guys, make sure you guys hit the video with a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already and drop some comments down below. Don't be shy. I really want to make this video so we can all interact with each other and talk about our predictions and our thoughts as well. But um, yeah, with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and transition into the predictions video. Alright, so originally I made this video and I uh, was like seven minutes in and I finished the recording, hopped on Facebook and everything, and then literally I, um, I saw this screenshot. And uh, it kind of just confirms what my predictions were going to be, was going to be, uh, you know, the main focus of the set was going to be around the Dragon Ball superhero movie. But, um, you know, as you guys know, each set usually has about four eras or sagas, whether it be from Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Super, Superheroes, or the movies. And it looks like this set is going to be mo bleh, mostly focused on the movies. As you guys can see in the picture, there's Super Android 13, Slug, and Super um, you know, Dragon Ball Superhero uh, Broly. Wow, I cannot talk right now, Jesus Christ. I, this is like my fourth time recording this video. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so I, I was right about one thing, about it being mostly themed around the superhero um, movie, which I am really happy with. They, I've already seen um, this SPR that I'll show right here beside me. This Orange Piccolo and Gohan uh, SPR, what I originally thought when I saw it was, this, was one of the secret rares, and I was like, holy shit, that's badass. But honestly, I feel like we're gonna talk about like the secret rares and stuff. I would love to see a Beast Gohan, Orange Piccolo, and a Cell Max is what I originally said in my first video, but I, now that I know this, I feel like it's gonna be all movie themed. I would love if they did like an, an orange uh, Piccolo and Gohan doing their special beam cannon, you know, as a secret rare together. We know they'll put them together as a secret rare. They did it on Ultimate Squad, and I feel like that card was really good and popular, so I definitely can see them doing that again especially since that was like one of the big crazy moments from the movie itself. I mean, even if they don't put them together as a secret rare, since they have this SPR that I showed a minute ago, I'll probably throw it up on screen again. But um, I feel like with that SPR being in the set, I feel like Beast Gohan might be by himself if he is a secret rare. And I feel like they probably won't give another secret rare representation for the superhero movie. So I would love, oh my God, I would love to see Super Android 13 has his own secret rare. That would be amazing. I love this character so much. I'm, I'm not really a fan of the trucker hat, but I do. When he transformed for the first time in the movie, I remember losing my shit when I was when I was little because I was just like, that is so cool. Like, I just love his design. He looks really cool, and his SS Deadly Bomber attack is just bom like it's just broken. I remember using him all the time in the Tenkaichi games. But uh, yeah, I would um. Definitely love to see uh, those two as secret rares and my third secret rare prediction or who I would like to see since they have you know Gogeta blue on one of the packs and you know Super Broly is on the back of the thing. I hope we get a Super Broly secret rare. I feel like he is desperately in need of one. I honestly hope they give it to uh, Super Broly over blue Gogeta but I can definitely see them going with either one. If they put both of them on the same card that would that would be insane, but I don't think they'll do that. Hopefully we don't see any like the superheroes like spin-off show. I hope we don't see any secret rare representation this time in the set, but they usually always give one representation for that show. I don't know why they keep doing that. Like Realm of the Gods, don't even get me started on Realm of the Gods. But um yeah, hopefully we see, you know, like those are my predictions and hopes for the secret rares. Beast Gohan, Android 13. Super Broly. That would be awesome. I would love if they did that. They did a really good job with the last set, Dawn of Z Legend, with their secret rares. They're all really badass. I loved all of them. But uh, I just, I wonder, I mean, I hope Slug's not chosen. I don't like Slug. He's really just a, like, I don't know, just don't care about him. Hope he doesn't, I hope he's like an SPR at the most. But uh, honestly, if they were to give one more secret rare to somebody, I hope it's the Gammas. Honestly, I, they kind of grown on me. They're really cool. I would love to see them like both in the same card with Dr. Hito and all of them doing some like 
poses or something like that with like the superhero like text behind them. I think that would be a really cool and fun card they could go with. But those are my predictions for the secret rares. Now another thing I want to touch base on is the new rarity for this set with the campaign rares. Um, I feel like now that I know that this set is going to be more movie themed, I definitely can see them going like the infinite Saiyan route and being like um, Blue Gogeta, Super Broly, Beast Gohan, uh, Orange Piccolo, Cell Max, Android 13, Super Slug, like stuff like them. I could definitely see them going, you know, that route with them. But honestly, I would also love to see them do like another signature card type of rarity. Like how they did in Assault of the Saiyans and Tournament of Power. Oh man, that would be, this set would be insane if they did something like that. But I really don't see them doing that. I really don't think they will. I don't know if they'll ever come out with more signature cards. I was honestly surprised that they did it in two sets. But um, yeah, the, I don't, I think they're just going to go the Infinite Saiyan route. And I think they're just going to pick like movie villains or something like that for those candidates. But, you know, I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts. I'd love to hear what you guys think about what secret rares might be what do you guys think about you know the set I had a I had a really big feeling like every time I recorded re-recorded the video I would always bring up like oh it's gonna be the main the main focus is gonna be superhero themed which it looks like it is and I'm totally okay with that I would definitely love to see some more superhero representation in the card game I definitely would love to see them do some like really badass secret rares with some of these movie characters but Got my fingers crossed. You guys know my predictions. I would love to hear your guys' predictions down in the comment section below. I think this, I think I'm gonna wrap the video up. Yeah, it's in about seven minutes or so. But yeah, thank you guys so much for checking out the video. I'd love to hear your guys' predictions, his thoughts as well down in the comment section. Don't be shy and let me know. Uh, I love interacting with you guys and stuff like that. But if you guys don't want to miss any of the future videos, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel because whenever they do start um, revealing some of the secret rares. I will make a video talking about each one and then once that all three are revealed I'll make another video so we can all discuss because maybe our opinions will change you know once they reveal the first one by the time the third one comes out you know maybe we could be like oh this first one's trash Meh. but um yeah so definitely stay tuned to that stuff I'm definitely gonna try and do more videos like this just because I like interacting with you guys and it seems like a better opportunity to do stuff like that but yeah thank you guys so much for being here taking time out of your day to listen to me ramble about some shiny cardboard have a great rest of your day, everybody, and I will catch you guys in the next.